Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to hopefully resolve an error alert you might be receiving on your computer that basically says to close programs to prevent information loss and then your computer is low on memory, save your files and close these programs. So in that case we're going to go through a couple of measures to hopefully resolve this issue for you guys. And the first thing we're going to do is head over to our start button and we're going to left click on that then we're going to type in system should be listed directly above the control panel so what you want to do is left click on that on the left side here you want to left click on advanced system settings underneath the advanced tab and underneath performance at the top left click on the settings button in the performance options window left click on the advanced tab in the middle underneath virtual memory where it says a paging file is an area on the hard disk that window uses as if it were RAM now this is going to be creating some virtual memory for us while it's not as good as the real thing it can definitely be good to free up a little bit of space especially on older computers in terms of memory so we're going to left click on this change button right here if this box is checked at the top this says automatically manage paging file size for all drives uncheck that since we can see underneath total paging file size for all drivers, the recommended size is 1024 megabytes or 1 gigabyte. That is what the custom size I'm going to set for these two fields will be. So underneath initial size, I'm just going to type in 1024 and I will do the same for maximum size as well. So we see our paging file size is 1024 megabytes or 1 gigabyte. So then I'm going to left click on OK. It's going to ask you to restart your computer before the changes can take effect. Um, I will postpone that for right now. So in order to free up even more memory, if we close out of these windows, we can head back over to the Start button, and what you want to do is type in GP Edit. Please know you have to be an administrator in order to edit these. So underneath Computer Configuration, Left click on the little drop down arrow next to administrative templates. And then left click on the little drop down arrow next to system. And then again next to troubleshooting and diagnostics. Then you want to left click on the folder that says Windows Resource Exhaustion Detection and Resolution. So click on that folder. So you want to double click on this setting on the right side here. So double click on that. On the three options on the left side here that says Not Configured, Enabled, or Disabled, left click on the option that says Disabled, and then left click on Apply and OK. And at this point you can close out of the local group policy editor and hopefully um, try to reset your computer and hopefully your issues will be resolved. So I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.